Welcome to Morning Man with Pastor Steve Myrie. This morning's topic, Into the Recovery Room. For we have not an high priest that cannot be touched with the feelings of our infirmities, but was in all points tempted, like as we are, yet without sin. Hebrews 4, verse 15. Have you ever noticed how hard it is to communicate with people who will not give you their attention? Pain will not continue to rehearse itself in the life of a preoccupied, distracted person. Distracted people almost seem weird. They do not respond. Every woman or man has something that they wish they could forget. There's a principle to learn here. Forgetting isn't a memory lapse. It is a memory release. Like carbon dioxide that the body can no longer use. Exhale it and let it go out of your spirit. Brethren, I count not myself to have apprehended, but this one thing I do, forgetting those things which are behind and reaching forth unto those things which are before, I press towards the mark for the prize of the high calling of God in Christ Jesus. Let us therefore, as many as be perfect, be thus minded, and if in anything ye be otherwise minded, God shall reveal even this unto you. Philippians 3, 13 to 15. Jesus set the infirm woman of Luke 13 free. She was able to stand upright. The crippling condition of her infirmity was removed by the God who cares, sees and calls the infirmity to the dispensary of healing and deliverance. <laughs> Let me tell you, you can call upon him even in the middle of the night, like a 24-hour medical center. You can reach him at any time. He's touched by the feeling of your infirmity. I speak healing in your spirit now. I speak healing to your mind now, every suppressed memory that comes every once in a while to haunt you. I speak in the name of Jesus that it will be removed. As we share today in the word of God, I pray that the Holy Ghost will roll you into the recovery room where you can fully realize that the trauma is over. <laughs> I'm excited to say that God never lost anybody he wasn't going to use mightily. May God reveal healing and purpose as we continue to seek him. The quote of today, forgetting isn't a memory lapse, it is a memory release. God bless you today as you go knowing you're walking into your future and forgetting your past.